This video is the first in a series of videos we are creating to explain how you can use SIGI with the Unity game engine. SIGI, or the Common Image Generator Interface, is an interoperability standard to connect an image generator with a backend host system. You can think of an image generator as a system or application that produces the visuals for your simulated environment. A host is the brains behind the simulation. If you do not have a host, you can download the Boeing Host Emulator, which we will be using. In this video, we will cover how to connect the host emulator with Unity and basic entity controls. Simblox has developed a SIGI SDK for Unity that is a simple plugin that works with the free version of Unity. To download the host emulator, go to siggy.sourceforge.net slash product underscore he dot php. The link will be posted in the description below. Download version 3 and then click on the version that says he 3.3.3 Windows 32. When it's finished downloading, open and extract the zip file. Click on the file that says hemoob3.exe and your host emulator should open. Make sure the host emulator is set up to use the correct IP address, receive port, and local receive port by going to File and then Setup. To set up your scene in Unity, go to your Projects folder in your Files and click on the Project. Then click on the SRC and then Assets folder. After that, click on Plugins and using the DLL plugins provided by Simblox, you should be able to run your project inside the Unity Editor. So first, run your Unity scene. Next, launch the Boeing Host Emulator. We already have a database loaded, so let's create an entity. To load an entity into a Unity scene, go to Actions, then Send Packet, and then Entity Control. Then for the Entity ID, set it to 1 and choose the Entity Type. Set the entity state as active and under animation state, press play and under animation direction, press forward. Check mark the loop animation and then hit send and close. You can also hit the joystick icon and it shows a variety of options. If you're spawning a helicopter, then the collective is equivalent to the rotor speed, which you can control by moving the slider up and down. 